just as so many people predicted, the first season of Lord of the Rings, The Rings of Power on Amazon Prime Video, was not only the most expensive series we've seen in history, but it also was a gigantic disaster. This needed to be a global phenomenon, a massive hit, but instead, like so many people said, what happened when you saw all the things they were introducing that did not exist in Tolkien's world into that world, it ended up being a complete and total failure. The fans despised it. And a lot of people who started this thing couldn't even get through the first season. Only 37% of U.S. Lord of the Rings, the Rings of Power viewers, finished season one. Nevertheless, you knew season two was on the way. They already had the contracts. They've already paid for it. All of these things and were set for a Another gigantic disaster for season two, but somehow Amazon had been pretty quiet, hadn't been too much promotion. People didn't even know when it was going to premiere. And then yesterday we got the word teaser trailer world premiere tomorrow. And just that announcement, it's kind of funny how much damage control they had to do. When you look at the hidden replies, look at all of these hidden replies, people just roasting it, people making fun of them. There's Gary got a hidden reply for Guy Ladriel. I mean, you're talking about hundreds and hundreds of hidden replies if we scroll all the way down here. Basically saying this has nothing to do with Tolkien. Well, here we are. The trailer just came out and already it's fucking ratio. Remember that first teaser trailer that came out during the Super Bowl hit with just a massive wave of dislikes that showed you where this thing was going? Well, here we are. Already at 21,000 dislikes and I guess... We might as well play it, guys. It's a minute and 40 seconds. Let's watch the teaser for the follow-up to one of the biggest disasters we've ever seen. An evil, ancient and powerful, has returned. Prepare yourselves. This way inside your mouth. At least you had Elrond doing fucking something. At least Elrond has a sword in this one. Jeez. Fake worms this way inside your mind. The rest of him slithers in. I think he has been here. I think he's been here among us all along. There he is. There's Sauron. Basically, it just looks like Hallbrand with some pointy ears, but uh, don't know how they missed that. Here we go. Every soul in Middle Earth is in peril. got to make sure we get all the diversity in here you got to get the black elf you got to get the black dwarf because again this is not tolkien this is not actually lord of the rings this is rings of power Now, this is the most surprising thing to me. New season, August 29th. That's that's right around the corner. We're talking about a couple of months. You waited till a couple months before to drop the teaser trailer, which if we know anything from the history of what we've seen, when those things happen, it means they're pretty sure that this is going to be a shit show. They know there's going to be a lot of backlash. They know there's not a lot of reason to promote this thing six, nine months ahead of time because quite frankly, they're going to get a ton of fan backlash. And already, you can see just the, the couple comments. Somehow, Sauron has returned. Elves, oh no, Hallbrand is actually Sauron. Hallbrand puts on a wig and pointy ears. Where did he go? Must have been the wind. He was in the forest with my mom while she was researching spiders right before she died. This trailer, it's only been out for a little over an hour, and it's getting slammed. Rightfully so. Uh, this thing is going to be a joke. It's going to be an abomination, just like we saw with the first season. It's going to get rejected. And already, Amazon knows it. That's why they had to hide all those replies trashing them. 
And now, I, I guess it's a matter of time. Do you think they're going to leave it? Do you think they're going to leave dislikes public? Do you think they're going to leave the comments on? I guess only time will tell. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments section below. Smash a like button. Subscribe to the channel. Ring the bell for notifications. Share this video out there. And I'll talk to you later.